Hey guys, I got a new series for you. Possibly a new series. I'm going to throw this video out to you and see what you think of it. State of Decay, Year 1 Edition. I'm using one of my unskilled characters. Like, this girl's literally no good at anything. She's one star. Thought I'd send her out on a little trip. Probably should have brought help, but, you know, I didn't really think too much into it. I thought, you know what, let's get her cardio up, her shooting skills up, and a bunch of other things. Well, I got in a little over my head when I stumbled upon this house and I was about to go search it, see what was in it. Turned out there was a zombie freaking horde and this stupid zombie will not die. It's the freaking strongest zombie I've seen in this game. And I've seen some relatively strong zombies on here. So right now, my stamina, if you notice the left blue bar on near my mini map, is decreasing rapidly. It decreases every time you swing with your melee, but it doesn't decrease whenever you shoot. And the red bar is my health. And right now, once you're out with your character and you've been exploring for a while, your character will get fatigued, which is what you're seeing on the screen, meaning your stamina will run out 10 times faster, which for my character, who's a one star out of 10 star every, at everything, is not very good. I'm over here missing shots while this zombie's trying to surrender to me, depleted half of my stamina bar. And the little execution I just did to him, it takes up even more of my stamina. So I'm like, alright, I, I think I'm good. I'm not too far from the safe house. I mean, I've only been exploring with this girl for mm, maybe two minutes. And I'm already fatigued. I'm thinking, you know what, let me just wipe out these last few. And you know what, that's good, that's great. I can just move on back to the safe house. Over here, not giving my stamina enough time to come back to me. It's right now, it's at around oh, a good 25% at the moment. Hiding in this bush because they can't see you, thinking I'm about to execute this zombie. It turns out it was a freaking screamer. I didn't even notice. Her shooting skills suck. And this stupid screamer summons a horde. I'm low on stamina, and there are literally at least 15 freaking zombies behind me. On this game, literally a group of three zombies can take you out pretty quickly. And right now, seeing this many zombies right behind me, I only had five bullets left empty now. <laughs> Low home stamina and even more are popping up by the second. Look at all the red dots on my map. This is freaking crazy. I'm just sitting up here, right here at the safe house. Can't jump over a tree log. And I'm getting raped by the down tree log right now. My character is out of breath. Literally, you're out of breath when we're only about 80 meters from the safe house. You can see it off in the distance. And I can't even run. Trying to hit these zombies with some zigzag crossovers, and it is somehow working. Get a little bit of stamina back, and I am gone. I am out of there. You saying, Bo, I'm a freaking Black Ops 2 zombie running after the transit bus. Hop over this wall and deplete the rest of my stamina. The door is literally right there. Only thing I need to do is open it and smack it closed in the zombie's face. Nothing can go wrong with that. Door won't close. Door won't close. I'm trying to kick the zombie in his face. Door won't close. Door closes on its own. I'm so lucky. You know what? I got to get in here. Got to get all this ammo before it rapes all my survivors in here. <laughs> got to get the, uh, I think I'm about to pull out the SKS and then I got to grab the ammunition for it. Some of my better some of my better guns are on my other, other characters, sadly. So I'm going to have to make do with what I have. I would have preferred to use one of those pistols, but, um, no, I'm not, not really feeling too confident in my pistol skills as of lately. Now I'm looking at the mini-map and I'm like, okay, so uh, where did all the zombies go while I'm over here setting all the stuff up? And I'm guessing that they apparently just disappeared into thin air and decided, you know what, we don't, we're not that hungry, we're, we're just gonna leave. And I'm like, oh no, don't run away now whenever I got all my ammo and I'm ready for you. Got my stamina bar, even though I just depleted half of it, running over here to the freaking wall. But, you know, it is what it is, and I get one of my better characters, Marcus, which is one of the characters you start out with in the game. In fact, he's the first playable character that you access in the game. And I, I got so much stuff for him. Uh, uh, his athletic character, his shooting's up, his fighting's good. You see, you can see all my good, all my stats right there in that little menu that I just pulled up. Everything is nearly maxed out with him, and I'm just coming over here saying, you know what? I'm ready for that whore at this time. I don't need any help. Trying to cheese this zombie by smacking him through this log, but he just keeps on falling back every time I hit him. So I get a little impatient and hit him with that execution. Now. 
that I have Marcus. I'm feeling a bit safer coming back over here to this wall, you know. I mean, this uh, church building, whatever kind of a building this is. And I see one of the characters in here because apparently a mission popped up to destroy a special infected, a special infected Zed, which is what I'm assuming they call the infected on here, or Zeds. The special ones, anyway. I'm, I'm not really sure. It's something with a Z. I decided to search this backpack and get some. I'm glad to get some 7.62 millimeter rounds because so far those have been the hardest for me to find. And I need to need those for my uh. SK, SKS rifle, which is a pretty good gun. You get about, I think it's 20 shots in there at once, 10 or 20 shots in there. Pretty sure I'll end up pulling it out whenever we fight them, but nice strange little message there on the wall. I swear I've seen that in a movie before. I think it was in that one of the Dead Rising. Not Dead Rising, but eh, I, I digress. But anyway, the uh, special infected is up ahead. I'm not aware of his exact position. I'm thinking he's just going to stay there until we get there. This game being as unpredictable as do you see how fast that thing is charging at me? I started freaking out. I freaked the heck out. I'm still freaking out right now. While my character's taking his precious time to reload the rifle. We, we just barely killed that. Oh, oh my god, we barely killed it, but I think it's time for the most depressing moment of day one of State of Decay to show you guys. Hope you're ready for it. Well, I just finished a mission since I was already out in the area, decided to go do it. And I saw this little orange dial on the map, but I couldn't figure out what it was. And whenever I hovered over it, it still wouldn't tell me what it was. So I decided to go investigate. And here I am thinking, you know what, I'm not about to run through that bush. Watch there be some huge steep drop and I end up dying because of it. So I take the smart route and I decide to go around and see if I was opening. Now see, I was right. And as I try to turn around and leave, I just pull an oh my god! Oh. 